Hello and welcome to the Gaming Circus. Today we are talking to you about the Ewok Warriors Unit expansion for Star Wars Legion by Atomic Mass Games. This uh, new expansion is coming out this Friday, which is the 21st of uh, July. From the front of the box you can see the eight models that you'll get in the expansion. And then on the back, there's a little bit of a description as well as the contents that you will receive inside the box. So in this one, you'll get eight plastic miniatures, two unit cards, five upgrades, one token sheet and one insert sheet. And this unit is compatible with the Rebel Alliance. So let's have a closer look at what you get in the box. So the first thing that we've got is this insert sheet, which has this lovely poster on one side. And then on the other side, you have the QR code, which will give you the instructions to build these lovely miniatures. And you've then got the miniatures themselves all laid out, built and painted as demonstration pieces, along with how to join the community for Star Wars Legion. So we'll get into the cool bit, which is the cards for the game. So we'll start off with the token sheet. You get two unit markers. You have the special forces one and the trooper one. You might understand that uh, why we have those two in a second when we have a look at the unit cards. You get surge tokens and you get these victory point tokens for the Bright Tree Village, which is pretty cool. The unit cards for the box is the Ewok Skirmishers, which is the troop option. So they have they have low profile and unhindered. They can take a heavy upgrade, a trooper upgrade, and an equipment slot. They have one health and one courage. They roll white dice, and they have a spear in melee, which is one black. And they move speed two. The Ewok Slingers, on the other hand, have the same upgrade bar down the side of one Heavy, one trooper, one training. They have independent surge, which is quite nice. So when you're not given the order, they will have a surge to hit or defend to bank for later on. Low profile, target one, and unhindered. They have one health and one courage. They have stones that they can throw in combat for one dice, one white dice. And then they have slings, which are primitive, which will mean that if they crit, it counts as a hit, but it's range one to two and is a black dice. So that is the two units you get. You'll notice that one is a trooper and one is special forces, which was why we had the two different order tokens there. So we have the Ewok Trapper, which is a trooper upgrade. You can add it to Ewok Skirmishers or uh, Ewok Slingers. It has one Ewok Trapper miniature and this unit gains one training upgrade icon. You have the Axe Ewok, which adds a red dice to the attack pool. Ewok Skirmishers or Ewok Slingers. Add one Axe Ewok miniature to the unit and the attack gains Pierce 1 and Impact 1. You have Call to Arms for the troopers. This unit gains one Suppression token. This unit gains Charge until the end of the round. And you can see that they've got the little training icon there. 
You also have Insatiable Curiosity, which is for an Ewok Skirmishers or Ewok Slingers unit, which is also a training upgrade. Choose an enemy unit in base contact with this unit. The unit leader has a heavy upgrade, gear upgrade, or weapon upgrade equipped. Discard one of those non-unique or limited upgrades. This unit suffers one wound. And then you have Forest Dwellers, which is for Trooper only, for Bright Tree Forest. So mostly for the Ewoks. This unit gains Scout at the start of the first activation phase. The unit gains a Dodge token. So it gives them that little bit of sort of defensive abilities. And that is all the side upgrades for these guys, which they all seem pretty cool. I'm quite interested to get them onto the table and see how they actually play. We also get the eight bases for the models, which are just the normal standard bases. And then we have the bit that you're always, always looking for. And that is the miniatures for this unit. So let's bring them up nice and close. So we have a nice little Ewok there with a little hammer. You have one that looks like it's got like a little log trap there. I'm assuming this will probably be the trapper. Your little axe Ewok. And then another Ewok with a sling or a spear, depending on your preferred choice. We also have some more Ewoks here with spears. With a sling option at the side. So there's a little bit of customization with these guys, which is going to be really nice and fun to build. So I'm looking forward to getting these built and being able to show them to you fully built. So that is everything that we get in the Ewok Warriors expansion. If you like what you're seeing and excited to see them in person, you can buy them now at our web store at www.thegamingcircus.co.uk and we'll get these out to you. If you like what we're doing and you're interested in seeing more unboxings in the future, don't forget to like and subscribe to stay tuned for any more updates from us. Have a lovely day and we'll speak to you soon. Bye!